Hey, it's Max of Screaming Cinema. We are in today with a large Kino Lorber Hall. Um, This is some of the review copies I received over uh, the last couple months here. Uh, Just came in for review. So if you're interested in picking up any Kino Lorber titles, these are some of their new releases that were of interest to me. So let's go ahead and kick things off. First up, we have The Hot Spot. This is a brand new 2K Master. Um, It's color graded and approved by the cinematographer, uh, directed by Dennis Hopper. It stars Don Johnson, Virginia Madison, and Jennifer Connelly. Looks like we're looking at an erotic neo-noir. So I've heard a lot about this, but I haven't seen it. So I'm excited to check it out with this new 2K Master. Has this nice slipcover, as you can see here. Special features are an audio commentary from entertainment journalist and author Brian Reisman interview with uh, Virginia Madison, interview with uh, William Sadler and the theatrical trailer. So that is Hotspot. Next up we have Horizons West. This is a Western uh, from director Bud Budiker. He is one of my favorites. I really like uh, Tall T and Ride Lonesome. And this Western looks like we're set in post-Civil War Texas with uh, Robert Ryan and Rock Hudson. So pretty cool disc here love the cover um and on the features of this one which i haven't seen yet is a audio commentary by film historian uh, toby roan and that's horizons west next up is the woman one longs for this is from uh, marlene dietrich um as the star so it's pretty cool it's a I think the back says it well. It's uh, she insisted her screen debut was the Blue Angel, uh, when in fact she captured, uh, catapulted to fame by this silent drama of 1929. So it's a silent film. And black and white, 77 minutes, has an audio commentary from film historian Galen Studlard, and the orchestral score in 5.1 and 2.0 stereo. So. It was really cool, especially for getting someone like that in their first uh, first role. And moving on to the night of the following day. This is Marlon Brando and Richard Boone in a uh, psychological thriller. You can see the back here. I like this. I've actually never seen this one either. So I'm pretty excited. A lot of these are new to me, whether it be ones I missed or ones that have been on my list, but I've been waiting for a a good copy to come out. Um, Special features on this one. There's two audio commentaries, one by Tim Lucas, who is always awesome. And the next by um, director Hubert Cornfield. So that is the night of the following day uh, from 1969. Last couple here. Um, Looks like I have one more Western and a documentary. So first up we have Quantes. And this is with uh, Fred McMurray and John Coventry. They're leaders of a gang of robbers trying to escape across the Mexican border. Uh, This is from Harry Keller and also uh, co-starring Dorothy Malone. And like a lot of these Kino uh, Westerns, they have kind of a stable of those who they use to access for commentary. I'm a really big fan of Kino's commentary tracks. They seem to be, um, you know, you're not going to get just ramblings on and talkings about the movie. I really like the ones of the film historians. This one's also by Toby Roan. Um, and this is again, Quantes from 1957 um, with a commentary and theatrical trailer. Last up here, we have Lust for Gold, A Race Against Time. Great tagline there, 10 days and 31,000 gold bars. So this is a documentary um, from a true story about a hunt for gold. It says it's also preceded by a featurette, which is called The Tomb, which is the same team in their efforts to unearth a Jesuit tomb said to contain millions of dollars of gold bars, jewels, uh, coins, and paintings. So Pretty cool. I'm a really big fan of, I think the gold rush was awesome. So it's cool kind of seeing a uh, modern day treasure hunters. And uh, in this documentary, there's also an interview with Arizona state historian, Marshall Trimble trailers, uh, and this clocks in 83 minutes. So 
that wraps up my keynote hall. I will be posting on my Instagram and website um, reviews of these films. So be on the lookout for that for the ones I haven't seen. Also dive into the special features, the look of them, how the scans are, uh, and just overall feel. So check that out. You can go to my Instagram at Screaming Cinema. And if you want more videos, I can do some one-offs on these. Go ahead and like and subscribe to my channel. So look forward to making more content for you guys.